Hello, this is Rick Smith for Trinity United Methodist Church in Prince Frederick, Maryland. And this is the daily prayer for Monday, January the 16th, 2023. And today I thought we would talk about uh, the book of Matthew when he talks about the Sermon on the Mount. And I'm going specifically over to the similitudes. Of course, not the whole part of it, but uh, I'm going to read from chapters, or excuse me, chapter 5, which is where this is found, verses 14 through 16. And it reads, You are the light of the world. A city on a hill cannot be hidden. Neither do people light a lamp and put it under a bowl. Instead, they put it on its stand, and it gives light to everyone in the house. In the same way, let your light shine before men, that they may see your good deeds and praise your Father in heaven. And I want to concentrate on that last verse, number 16. I'll read it again. In the same way, let your light shine before men, that they may see your good deeds and praise your Father in heaven. Can you think of anything more important than doing anything that lets people see the glory of God and that it, as it says here, allows people to see your good deeds and praise your Father in heaven? Think about it. We have an individual in our church that is part of the staff who does this all the time right in front of us, whether you realize it or not. Our director of music, Leah Woods, lets her light shine and uses her gift of music and the knowledge of music, as well as her passion for God and her love of God, and puts it all together. Don't you feel so warm and enjoy so much listening to her music that she puts together. This helps us to celebrate God. Like this, you should do likewise. I don't know everybody's gifts. I know some, but I don't know everyone's. But I do know you have a gift, whether you think so or not. God does. I don't know anyone that hasn't had a gift given to them by God. And for some, it's many gifts. So remember, God wants your light to shine. Your gift can be the light. More importantly, though, as it mentions here, your good deeds, your good words, and your actions Let it show that you are a Christian, that you are a believer of God and Jesus Christ and the Holy Spirit. Let us pray. Father in heaven, teach us, show us, lead us to be the people you want us to be so that the light of the world, Jesus Christ, is seen in each and every one of us, not for our glory or our, for our sake, but for yours, so that people will come to you and want to be a part of this great and wonderful world that you have given us. Thank you for your love and compassion on us, and may we always try to Bring forth the light of the world, Jesus Christ, into other people's hearts. This we pray in your most holy name. Amen. So, do your best to let your light shine. I'm as guilty as the next person of not always doing that. Uh, Sometimes ill-tempered, sometimes not being as kind or generous as I could be. But you've got to try and Do the deeds God wants you to do, not what's going through your mind. 
So this is Rick Smith speaking for Trinity United Methodist Church today, which is January the 16th, 2023, Monday. And remember, as long as you are doing these deeds, Jesus is walking with you.